Okay, today we're going to program in a new Lucas fob into our Land Rover Defender, which is a 2011 plate, to replace a fob that was broken using our fob Land Rover Defender fob programmer. Okay, first thing we need to do is test the remote. Okay, so as we can see, when I press the button on the remote, we are having a signal from left and right. Okay, perfect. Okay, next thing we need to do is plug it into the diagnostic socket. In this case, the socket on this one is in the fuse box. A bit tricky to get to, but you plug it in, you'll see the blue light will come on to say that it's powered up. It'll go out and then it'll come back on again. When it comes back on, we have 45 seconds to press the remotes eight to 16 times. So I'm gonna do the new remote first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. And then the next one, you'll hear the acknowledgement. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, the system has now acknowledged both remotes. What we do now is we wait for the flashing blue light to finish flashing. Any other remotes that are not programmed in at this time have now been deleted. Okay, so we'll wait for this to switch off. It'll flash rapidly to tell us that it's gone outside programming mode like that. We then just unplug it. Okay, like that. Turn the ignition off. Turn the ignition off. Okay, and test the remotes. So, first of all, this one. Locked. And where are we? Unlocked. And then the original remote locked. Okay, and unlocked. Done. So that's our Land Rover Defender FOB programmer from Car Alarm and Radio Services. Okay. Thank you for watching.